This is self-explanatory. And after having heard this, we decided to squeeze Chinatown in Den Haag into our day. But of course not without a wonderful brunch again in our favorite place. So here we go again from homemade wonderful soups to terrific sweets. Well, and this bird is always around, obviously a daily visitor too. We meanwhile knew that Yilada Wellness is right opposite and after it had been recommended by the owner of the cafe, we spontaneously decided to have a wellness massage one after the other before leaving to Chinatown. So we all remained in Kaiserstraat until each of us was done, full of energy, fit and ready for the city. In Yilada Wellness you can have all sorts of massages, mainly Thai, and it was very clean, very friendly people. Uh, with only slight difficulties concerning the language. Recommendable. So here we are in tram number one, going to the Hague city. And although it was raining a bit, we were excited to go and see Chinatown. Not yet knowing we'll be back faster than expected. Well, we didn't see any signs, but this was definitely the entrance. And apart from this about maximum 500 meters, uh, there was a second one. So we went in and my God, was I disappointed. Whoever told us how large and impressive it is has definitely not been to any other of the other Chinatowns. And if you have, don't go here. There's a lot of normal shops like supermarkets, like uh, nail design studios, like tailors, like hairdressers. And I bet there are more Oriental restaurants here than Chinese. Here this is American and you can find fast food, fast food, fast food. There's one restaurant that was uh, recommended to us, but absolutely crowded. And uh, when we looked onto the plates, it looked just like every Chinese meal that I can get in Germany, whether in uh, cheap or more expensive restaurants. Not a single shop that I saw where you can buy typical Chinese things like textiles, porcelain, Chinese herbs, whatever, not even chopsticks. So we are talking about two small streets where you hardly can find anything Chinese and I don't understand why the Chinese community should there be any in The Hague doesn't object. We passed a mosque on one side and later sat in front of a Jewish memorial 
when we sat outside for dinner in a fantastic Japanese restaurant. So at the end of the day we went to a fantastic Japanese restaurant in Chinatown. It was all too confusing and too upsetting and I was so disappointed and we all decided this was not worth the trip. So we went home as fast as we could. Thank you.